Hey guys, and welcome back to more Kingdoms of Amalur. Alright, um, we're gonna be starting off a little bit boring right now because we're just going to run and turn in a quest. I know that's plenty exciting for you, I'm sure. And I'm not exactly. Rotting hell, the sun is fierce today. Hmm. Not exactly. Like, I haven't played in so long that the I have forgotten. Oh, it was a board thing. Outside. Always things to be done about the keep. Y yeah, uh, that's great. I found Eldrick Orhelm dead. Oh! The guy who was in the place where I was doing the lore stone thingies. Yes. Dead? Why, that's a shame. I'd say I'm sure he'll be missed. But he's from Whitestone, so you never know. You know, she's oddly and that's cheery. His walking staff there. I'll take that. Job well done. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Well, isn't right, that now. a shame? That's basically what she said. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm obviously way too familiar with like the Fallout controls now. What shall we do? Cloud Crest. The prison of Niskara Lord Kamaz Kamazandu is in the Cloud Crest Mountain, Hollowlands, and your Besom. Will be Argon. Um, shit, two left. Where? I guess it's just what? Iron Fast can be well to play. Blah, 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 blah. Kill spiders in this region. Okay. So let's just deliver the package then. That's actually pretty far. Okay. Well, all our quest seems to be leading us away from this yes. general area, so I guess we'll be doing that. And yeah, I know my frame rate sucks right now. Dust, but dents, and scars. It just That's does it. not like this building. This building is much too grand for it, apparently. <laughs> too much rendering. Too many little details and too many people walking about. Oh, that must be it, the people. Remember when I killed, like, the entire... Like... Oh, what was it? Like, the people who worship death. I killed, like, all of them in, on a bridge. Means you haven't used it yet. And it's just... Was not good. I'm sorry if my, like, speech is, like, this... It's distorted? No, not distorted. What I mean to say is my speech is... Oh, I saw that coming. I couldn't dodge it. What am I even trying to say? I'm trying to say that my speech, like, I keep stopping to speak. No, I keep not... Oh, forget it. <laughs> forget it. Anyways, I do it because... Like, NPCs around me start talking and then I try to listen to them. You know? How's my inventory, by the way? Not that great, but better than I'd hoped. Is it just leading me? I swear there was two. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, God. Okay. So yeah, my usual inability to speak coherently has struck again, apparently. <sighs> now, really. <laughs> oh, and today I have hot tea with me, so I will not be like... I know you guys don't really notice it that much, because I do try to... Um, I do try to mute the microphone when I do, but I have been coughing a lot lately whenever I record and I don't know I think it, I think I must have some sort of asthma or something I know I did when I was little sort of for a little while oh bones it's oh ew I don't want that I'm just going up here for the lower stone by the way although this area looks like it's Finally, the have I been here the ever with clouds by In any case, I want to see what and this is. Okay, they're up there, so whatever. 
But yeah, I've been coughing a lot while recording and it's been bothering me because, well, coughing does not make a very good recording. <laughs> I'm sure nobody wants to hear that. And yeah, solution, tea. Hot tea. Uh, where'd you guys come from? Zungar Outlaw. These are new. I'm not a thug. You know? You're the ones who are thugs. Little bitches. <laughs> And I know there has been a lot of news going around lately about the makers of Kingdoms of Amalur, um, about 38 studios and big huge gaming um, closing, declaring bankruptcy and all that. And um, it is a sad, sad deal, you know? I really enjoy this game and I would like to see more here from them, but yeah. But there has also been the news of Epic Gaming's um, picking up some of the old crew from 38 and Big Stry. Big, 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 big games. Big, 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 big. If you're wondering why the fuck I'm just uh, repeating big, it's because I suddenly cannot remember the word that's in the middle. It's Big Something Studios, but I suddenly cannot remember the word. I just said it, like, a minute ago. What the fuck? Big huge. Big huge studios. <laughs> uh, so bad. Oh. Why does it have an exclamation mark next to it? This piece of paperwork is left behind by officials of Modus Mining Company, the known business concern, once based in Aptir. Exit report. It is done. Snake Tail Grotto has been closed. The bodies have been buried. Bodies? What? All obvious traces of the refinement unit disaster have been recovered and sealed. If the gods are good, no one will ever question our intentions here. Modus Mining built Whitestone and Apatir. We will forever be servants of the people. But the time has come to move on. All operations are henceforth being moved to new sites in Hollowlands. Interesting. I'm still confused why it has a little thingy next to it. Alright. Oh, this tea is so good. I don't even know what's really in it. I know it has like some kind of berries in it. <clears throat> it's got flower petals of some kind. Rubibos tea. Oh, it's a part of a chain of quests? Oh shit. New area, more quests. <laughs> and I guess... I don't know. With the coming of, well, you know what? I'll save this speech because I'm gonna be running well, into a lot well, of well. stuff. Well, well, well. Never seen your face before. Can't say I like it. Uh, excuse me. Listen up, dog face. There are two rules in Bone Town. Number one, Mayor Eswin's law is absolute. Number two, if you don't like rule number one, then you'd better get your ass out of town. Now go meet the mayor yourself. He likes to know what the kobolds kick in from the wastes, especially with the families running wild. Okay. Listen to that. You're fitting in pretty well already. I'll see you around Whitestone, Dogface. What a rude, rude man. I've half a mind to do all the quests in this place and then come back and kill him. Ah. You guys know my playstyle. <laughs> Piss me off, you're dead. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. Is it, is it stealing? There's no... There's no percentages next to it. Something happened? No. Okay. I'll take it. I don't know why it was red. There was no percentages next to it saying that it was stealing. Mayor Eswin isn't paying me enough for this. Mayor Eswin sounds like a dick. Loot bedrolls. Jeez, I'm just walking around taking people's shit while they're just... Oh, I can't... What? 
Why wasn't I able to? Whatever. This game sometimes. <laughs> no loitering. Keep the streets clear. Yeah, yeah. What a bunch of hard asses. All right, more quests. Great. Oh, you're in a cage. Well, isn't this Dragon Age Origins esque? Good day. You're probably wondering what. And your I'm name is Stag. Here. Well, if you're fond of a good story, lend me your ear. I won't disappoint. He's I've tried to keep it short, even though I've got all the time in the world for embellishment. Okay, he's one letter short of Sten, and he's in a cage. <laughs> all right, what'd you what do? What did I do? Nothing. I just happened to bear the name Dark Vari, a crime in upper tier in these trying times. Why? And blade seized me at the gates of Odessa. Here's the trick of it. I was leaving home, slipping free of my familial bondage. I'm no thug. I am guilty of but one crime only. Stealing a girl's heart. <laughs> well, aren't you melodramatic? Her name is Hrindi Zunga. And at this very moment, she waits for me with no word of my whereabouts. Please, stranger, will you help me? Tell me about... Hrindi. She is the sun <laughs> that comes to warm me every morning. Oh, please. We met a short time ago. Mere weeks. But true love has no memory of time. Yes, Zungars and Darkvari aren't exactly kin. In fact, they're sworn enemies and rivals. Oh, it's a Romeo Imagine and Juliet how affair. Would they be if they shared blood instead of spilled it. Really? <laughs> All right, all right. I knew I liked you from the moment I laid eyes on you through these enormous Mr. Sten bars. Romeo, come on. Getting the key won't be easy. Bjorn, the head of their mercenaries, carries it on his person. I wouldn't want to be the one who has to rifle through his pockets. Well, that should be easy because I plan to kill him. Okay, fine. No, I'm not going to just kill him. <sighs> Hi. He is a rude motherfucker, though. Says I, with a potty mouth. <laughs> Grand Darkvari and his cousins have made a crooked living attacking and looting gnome shipments. Oh, really? From Adessa. If you're looking to score some quick coin, you could raid a Darkvari family and in the raise, blah, blah, blah. Oh, sure. The government of Whitestone is always seeking help securing the peace. If you'd like to earn some extra gold by hunting down a wanted bandit, take one of these contracts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kidnapping and black markets. Marketers. The Sinric family has plagued the government of Whitestone, both path and present. Now with the gnomes gone, the Sinrics have taken over much of Apatir. Do the right thing and you'll get paid. And laid. No criminal in the history of Apatir has terrorized a populace like Feld Zungar. His group of murderers and... Ah, oh, Zungar, those people that I met outside. No longer satisfied to live on the fringes of society. Now they wish to overthrow law in Whitestone altogether. Help the good folk of Apatir kill the Zungars. Over here. Great. Lovely. Who just said over here to me? You? Hello there. Normally I'd be seeking help with some of our mercenary contracts. Your, your voice is but weird. It looks like you've collected all of them already. I'll leave you to your work then. What? So long. Why did you call me over if that was all you had to say? Useless, I say. Um. Whatever. There's a quest mark here. I'm not sure for what. Oh, Brother Till's books. We haven't had. Stay out of trouble. Well, we have, but. That was that weird thing where it led to a guy, and I couldn't figure out... <laughs> hi? <gasps> this is Mayor! Stand right there. Let me take a look at you. Filthy, weary, Come on. Look lonely... Look at me, I'm clean! Not special, that's for certain. We don't see folks like you in Whitestone very often. I'm Mayor Eswin Elfhelm, and I'm the closest thing to a friend you've got around here. Really? And why would I need a friend? Some call it war. I call it survival. The modus mining interest left an empty throne when it abandoned Apotir. 
And now everyone wants that power. The people here, the decent, honest, hard-working people of Apotir, have been through enough. Starvation, humiliation. They needed a leader. One who cares. And I suppose you think My that's you. My goals are simple. To stop the warring in Whitestone. And to rescue it from the brink of extinction. And you, you can help me. What do you say? Partners? And what will I be doing? I like you. You're not a fool. Want to know what you're getting into? Well, I think big, but I'm smart enough to start small. I need a person who can do both. I want you to acquire something for me. Something that rightfully belongs to me. Really? Well, alright. I don't know if I'd normally do this quest, but... Since I'm trying to show off, like, all these side quests... There's a man named Adath Scoria, patriarch of the most prominent mining family in Apotir. Months ago, I bought his family mine. It wasn't cheap. Now Adath refuses to surrender the property. In fact, he's gone into hiding and won't meet with me. I need you to acquire what is legally mine. The deed to his claim. Modus Mining stored all the records in its old headquarters east of the village. But the building has long since been overrun. Get that deed, and we're in business. Alright. That doesn't sound too bad, actually. I was expecting him to want me to do something much worse. Like, I don't know, killing a man and taking something powerful. I like how he just does not give a shit that I just opened his secret door. Oh. What was the... was it V? Was it C? But yeah, um... Wait, 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 wait. There's another person in here? Jeez. I didn't even know. I like how none of them care that I'm in here. <laughs> and those gold coins, like, trickling down, making noise, who cares? The mayor actually doesn't seem like that bad a person. He's better than I expected, that's for sure. Shit, I only have three. Shit. Shitting me? Come on. Haha, <laughs> thank you. Woo. All that for a lockpick and a lamb and for shit. Alright, where's where's the bookshelf? Oh. Well then. I wonder if there's a way to earn that legitly. And I suppose Till's book is here? Yes! Thank you. And I'll read that. My Grandmother's Pearl. It was a fantasy, but satisfying nonetheless. No one would gossip in her dreams. No one would reject, re would reject her advances. She could be with any and all she desired, man or woman, alpha or no. There was always a hint of guilt to accompany her wishes, but the fulfillment of them washed away any distaste. Thereby pleasured, she could cope with her loneliness and make bearable the days until she could enjoy her nights. What the fuck? Slowly, however, her depravity deepened and her previous imagination could not satiate her new lusts. The thoughts from before were now trite. She was no longer content with a passionate embrace and confided in herself new, unspeakable acts of pleasure and pain. Uh. <laughs> if she felt guilty before, she was now wholeheartedly ashamed. The impurity of thought sullied her every hour, drifted through her thoughts in the most inappropriate place at the most scandalous times. No one was free from her uncontrolled thoughts, and she feared they would consume her in a sinful, wallowing hedonism for the rest of her life. It was to her shock and horror, then, to find that not only did she give utterances to her throes of passion on a nightly basis whilst asleep, but that her manservant had heard every word while standing by her bedroom door. Uh-oh, spaghetti -o.
Huh. That passage does interest me, but I'll save that for later. I kind of want to look around Whitestone itself a little bit more. Yeah. Be on your guard. Oh, trust me, I am. Let's go into. What is this? This is a blacksmithing forge. Alright. A general store. Nice. Maybe they have a backpack here? Huh? Hello. Hello? Don't kill me, please! Whoa, whoa. Just a little white stone humor for you. Hmm. Maybe it's not for everybody. No, not exactly. My name's Varric Dunbert. In my trade selling. We get a quirky collection of goods in town these days. You're welcome to it. Okay. Nope, you do not have any backpacks. You are freaking fucking useless. Uh, I suppose I could look at this. Nope. Huh. Another one of the Magus's ring. Now those plus ones aren't exactly that important to me. I think I just might get it. I mean, why the hell not? I have so much money. Is like, what the fuck? Mm. Yeah, 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 I know. Accidentally. And the bow can go. Crafter's hands I save because it's usually my break stuff one. Huh. Yeah, whatever. No. no. Sell that. This isn't Nope. And you can all go now. Cause I know you guys aren't worth it. And I got a gold nugget. But it's stolen, right? So I can't. Well, ain't that unfortunate. Skull, bones, like what the fuck? Get out of here. I only have five repair kits. I'll get more. Ugh. Alright, goodbye. Oh, chemical lab? Like, I don't know, guys. It's just like. I don't use my potions enough. It's such a bother to. <laughs> I don't put that sword away yet. Got a lot of boxes to smash. I should probably visit Oh, but there is one on the way that I need to go to, and oh my god. Uh, wait for it. I don't think it's coming. You guys are probably really confused what the fuck I'm talking about. But I really had to sneeze for a moment. <laughs> I was like, am I going to? Am I going to? No. Okay. Dear Varric, don't worry about me, I'm in good hands. The Cynrics are a riotous lot, but no m more than any of the rest of us. They still have some honor, despite their real and recent villainy. It's a shame they've had to fall so simply to stay alive. Wait. Fall, fall so far. 
simply to stay alive. <laughs> Isn't that the way of Apatir? I'll be in touch, my friend. If anyone asks about me, send them away from the quarry, even our allies. I can't risk having that snake Esmin discover my location. Unchecked, he will stop at nothing to crush all of Whitestone under his well-manicured thumb. City dwellers. Was that... What was that old joke? How can you tell if a man's a noble? Check his... Okay. Be well, Varric. You'll be hearing from me soon. W what? How can you tell if a man's a noble? Check his... Okay. Don't understand, but... Whatever. You're not very good at jokes, old man. Wait, you're Varric, so that wasn't you who wrote it. Hello. Damn, even with my tea, I'm starting to cough a bit. This is rather frustrating. Nice barrel fountain? I guess. Okay. Well, I'm gonna cut it off here. So I'll see you guys next time on Kingdoms of Amalore.